Welcome back to another video guys. Back out here on the Harris chain, fishing an ABA tournament today. Uh, it's one week after the BFL tournament that I just uploaded. So if you haven't watched that one, definitely go check that out. Uh, I finished third and got big fish in that one. Bunch of big fish in that video, so that's pretty cool. Definitely check that out either before or after this video. I'll link that one below and up here. Uh, but yeah, just put in the boat here. It's about 5.30, probably gonna launch in about half hour, 45 minutes. Pretty much just gonna run the same pattern as last week. Hopefully those fish are still out there. Uh, fishing that shell bed that I caught all those big fish on. I'll probably run some brush piles today. Uh, I've heard that that spot's getting a little bit crowded. So we'll see what happens once we get out there. Uh, but today we're gonna have a five fish limit instead of that three fish limit that we had for the FLW BFL last week. Uh, so hopefully we can crack over 20. I'm really hoping 25 plus uh, if those big fish are biting. So we'll see. I have a feeling it's gonna take probably close to 30 today to win this tournament. Uh, but I get to give a big shout out to Ronnie Green from A Fishing Story. If you guys haven't heard of the TV show, A Fishing Story with Ronnie Green, definitely check that out. Uh, he's been a big supporter of me and this channel. So just wanted to give a quick shout out to him. Thank you, Ronnie, for everything you do to help me out. Uh, we're gonna head over to the boat now, head over to the launch, and uh, hopefully we can put five big fish in the boat today. Unless it's like a three plus, I don't need the net. <laughs> Can I help you out? Yeah, you're good. Unless I say something, then we're all good. There's one, that's a good one. Stay down, baby. <laughs> yeah. I'll get the net whenever you I get him close, I'll let you know. So I'll take the net whenever he gets close. Two. All right, here he comes. Ooh. All right, there he is. Thank you. Something must have happened because all three of us just hooked up right there. Three. Uh -huh. Yeah, just over three on that guy. I think he's he's small. I think I don't know, maybe not. Yeah, he ain't that big. I got him. There's one. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, it's like a three pounder. This side. Perfect, thank you. That one ate it. Look at that. Good thing here. There's one. That's a good one. I don't think he's huge, but he might help. Up a little bit. A little bit, huh? Yeah, just by a few ounces. That's a, yeah, that's a good one. It's a good one too. Coming on this side. Oh my god. Yeah. God. All right, coming up. Good. Nah, it's like an eight. <laughs> yeah. Seven and a half. guys we're back in the truck here after the tournament uh, it started pouring rain so unfortunately I had to put the GoPros up for about the last 45 minutes or so of the tournament uh, what you guys didn't see is I caught a six pounder in about the last five minutes of the tournament before I had to run in uh, so that boosted my total up pretty good I ended up weighing 2263 and that got me fifth place I had a small penalty for a dead fish uh, one of those fish choked the crankbait and unfortunately didn't make it uh, but that's what happens when they eat it good like that. He was bleeding like crazy, so nothing I could really do. Put the juice in there and uh, caught him early, so he just unfortunately didn't make it throughout the day. Uh, but definitely happy with a fifth place finish in that one, 22.63. It was a pretty tough day last weekend. I was catching a lot of fish. Uh, this week, the spot I was fishing kind of came a community hole area. Uh, some other people caught on to it. So I had to run a lot of new stuff today. But luckily I had some other areas to run to that I could catch some fish off of uh, and everything worked out for me. Took 26 to win the tournament, so definitely a little bit of a tougher bite out there today. I uh, only, only caught probably like 15 fish when last week I caught probably 40 or 50. So definitely a tougher bite. Uh, but luckily we got that seven and a half in the boat and then I caught that six pounder right before check-in. Uh, to boost my total up there but uh thanks guys for watching this like i said at the beginning of this video go check out a fishing story with ronnie green uh, it's on discovery channel and some other networks basically anywhere that you can find 
any fishing show these days on Roku and stuff like that. So definitely go check that out. Uh, big shout out to Ronnie from there for supporting the channel. And we'll see you guys at the next one. Oh, 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 oh,